UFC Superfan. This video has uh, been a long time coming. I've been meaning to do it for a while now, but I haven't had uh, the time and it took me a while to get everything together. But uh, this video is all about one of my favorite fighters, Kung Lee. Uh, he retired uh, earlier this year and retired from MMA. Uh, due to a couple of disputes with the UFC, you know, I think he had some issues with uh, drug testing and you know some of the results that came out. But uh, this is all about his cards, my memorabilia for him. So let's get to it. Okay, so I have a couple of his regular base cards: uh, 2013 finest. And this is 2013 uh, Knockout. I have a whole bunch of his relics and I have some bonus things at the end of this. So, 2014 Knockout, Relic out of 188. Knockout. 2013, if you guys can see that, out of 188. Bloodlines. Fighter Worn Relic. Out of 198. So Kung Lee, you know, he hasn't started, he didn't start in MMA, he started in, um, I think like Sand Shao or Kickboxing. Nice little matte relic here, non-numbered. I remember watching late at night on ESPN uh, some of his San Shao fights. Uh, he'd always beat up on like this white guy. I think they replayed it like a hundred times, uh, and he was just absolutely destroying him. Like he was taking him down. He was doing like these cartwheel takedowns. This is out of 188. One of the tiny matte relics. Uh, and I'm really glad that he got his chance uh, in MMA. Fighter, fighter worn relic and autograph combination out of 299. <clears throat> Probably my favorite fight of his it was one that he didn't even win. And this, this is just some of the uh, through the mails. Uh, it was his, I think, first fight in the UFC against uh, uh, Silva, Wanderlei Silva. It just went back and forth, and uh, Kung. He just had that brutal, brutal, like, nose break. Um, but he definitely put on a fight for the fans, and uh, I think that's what I will remember his career for. So I got another one autographed, too. I don't know why I, don't know why I sent him two, but anyways, he signed both anyways, so nice. So I did meet him in person, and uh, I got a promo of his. I'll show you guys that. This was at the 2013 uh, fan, UFC Fan Expo. We'll get a close up of his signature, and then you guys you can see the promo. It's a pretty nice promo. When I met him, I asked, I said, how'd you get so buff? <laughs> or something like that. He said, he works out all the time. And then this is a, a pretty sweet piece. Get a zoom up of the autograph. Nice. I think this was this is a gold paint pen, uh, but nice signature. Came out very clean and uh, kind of a, the icing on the cake for my Kung Lee collection. So uh, I actually only have one, I guess, official Tops autograph, but uh, tons of other autograph stuff. So. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I think Kung Lee said he might come back to regular kickboxing. Um, and if he does, I'd be very interested if he competes for like glory or maybe, you know, just some uh, exhibition bouts. That'd be fantastic to see. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, UFC Superfan out.